Well, hello there, ladies and gentlemen. You're back with Dead Deck, and today we're playing some more King of Retail. So, I did go and check which day I actually got this pop-up shop. It was on the 4th. So, if the first day doesn't count the 15th, this should be the last day? I don't know. I thought I'd worked it in a better way than that, but apparently not. Let's go. It's a good job I did order some stock anyway. But I'm expecting this shop to shut down. I've said that for the last, like, three days now. And again, wouldn't it be nice if we could take all this cash that we'd earned extra with us? That would absolutely kickstart us. I'd just go and open a clothing shop and an electronics shop in one fell swoop. We've got the uh, the capital to make it work. Well, actually, you need to get a, uh, a HQ first as well, I believe. But, yeah, we're not going to get this cash. We're going to get the, I think it's like four and a half grand bonus for finishing the contract. At least that's the plan, which we could actually start a, um electronic shop with that. Just a little phone shop. I do think that's where we're going to start. And to be fair, pardon me, by the way, I probably should go for more than 20 grand, but I think I'm going to cut it fine. Nobody's queuing yet. Yeah, let's get both these shoe racks done. Shut up. I've never whistled a retail worker in my life. I wouldn't dream of doing it. Not unless I wanted some teeth knocking it. He did deliver all the stock, didn't he? I did order yesterday's sales. I've not unpacked everything. Stupid. I wondered where stuff was. Right, now we've unpacked everything. Good, good, good. And we've got a queue at half past four in the morning in a clothing shop. It wouldn't be one of my episodes of King of Retail if I didn't moan about them coming shopping at this time, would it? But, again, I am going to be doing full days for all of the shops that we do on this playthrough. It just makes it easier. And it's not like you pay more money based on how long the shop's open. It's generally just you pay your rent for the day. Although, from what I've read of the guide, again, the one that Sir Oak linked onto my Discord, that's pinned in the King of Retail channel. Um, where was I going with that? You want to buy properties, not rent, because the rent is just astronomical. You actually want to own the buildings yourself. Let's get this back wall we'll finished off, then shoes, then we can work back towards the cash register. Let's go. Let's go. Hi. Nope. Can you not see that I am mega, mega busy, lady? Just pick up some shoes or a skirt or a top and leave. I know. I saw you. Don't think I didn't. Goddamn nightmares whistling. Right, we know we're going to break two grand. Uh, two, two grand. I should hope we're going to break two grand. We're already on nearly 200,000. Um, can we break 300 grand? I absolutely doubt it. I don't think there's enough stock in the building to be able to do that. But Right, let's not get too comfy because we do want to still go and try and convince people. I'm not bothered about the riffraff out there and if they're bothered about coming in or not. If the pop-up shop doesn't end today, I genuinely don't know when it will end. But I don't really want to keep going with this pop-up shop because we're making no progress. This money that we're earning isn't mine. If this money that we were earning was mine, then happy days. We could have ploughed this into a new shop by this point, but it's not. It's not. And we could be got to get blah. we could have got some staff and we could have got some managers in and see that's what I'm looking forward to. Self sufficient shops. We'll get the bare minimum staff. I am going to try and do the same rotor system that I did in the second half of my last series. So they get multiple days off. Um, and then that way they don't tend to phone in sick as much. No, don't hyperspeed the talking. Yeah, that was always going to be close. This might be a bit better. Alright, then you're just very, very um, needy in the happiness department. Unfortunate, we could have done. Uh, we could have done business. Hey, can you help me? Maybe in a second, lady. I'm coming. 
quick sale. Thank you. And that's some... See, this is another thing. All the time I'm building popularity for this store that we'll be leaving. I want to be building popularity up in a store that actually means something. Because it is really hard to get the popularity of a shop up. Is there even a way to check how popular the shop is? Customer reputation. Ah. Apparently we're not very popular with the accountants. Well, my bad. Ooh, I press speed up rather than... E. Everybody be patient. Everybody be patient. We're getting there. Speaking of accountants, they're white shirts. You don't see accountants come in all that often. Well, we, we've not specifically gone through everything and picked out, like, for all the genres, have we? I've just done, like, a few from column A, a few from column B, blah, blah, blah. Work from the bottom, work from the top. We've not put any thought into anything that we've put in this shop. That's why I said last episode a fair few times. This store upsets me. So I've put the least effort into it and it's been by miles the most profitable and the most easy to get off the ground. We can do the same thing in a computer shop. Absolutely can do the same thing in a computer shop. I keep saying computer shop. An electronics shop. See, he had a white hoodie. We are getting accountants in here. I've got a second. Sell to the accountant. Who weirdly wants white trainers. Your need isn't high enough. You're not going to buy them, are you? Oh, he did. I thought if the need was grey, they weren't buying it. I didn't have time to get your need up. I had somebody whistling at me. Uh, you're the closest. Yes, that's how my customer service works. It's uh, proximity based. Two quick sales. That's all I've got time for. There's a lot of people wandering around here. Mm -mm. Yeah, I need to calm down though with my recording. I did mention last episode people recommending other games or how the shop should work or anything like that. It is currently the 1st of July for me. It is the 1st of July, right? June. It's not July. Get away with you. Yeah, it's the 1st of June, and this episode's coming out on the 13th. Ugh. Yeah, two weeks in front with recording. I've just been enjoying the games I've been playing recently. All right. That's the only reason. I mean, obviously, one of them was the new Resident Evil, and I really went full ham getting in front with that, but the story was great. I do have to show off at some point, by the way. If any of you is interested, I am doing Shadow uh, Village of Shadows difficulty. I'm not doing a series of it, I'm just playing it myself. I've got a pistol that's got limited ammo. And um, I'm trying to do the game with that. I'm about to get to Lady Dumitresque for the first time. Well, obviously she's the first boss. Taking her on with a pistol might be a nightmare. This is why I've been trying to finish off the mercenary missions to get as many uh, collection points, CP, so I can get as much CP as possible, so I can get as many guns as I can that's got limited ammo. Thank you. Trust me, on Village of Shadows difficulty, you're absolutely going to need unlimited ammo. And so far, the hardest bit has been the first bit, where you're getting bombarded by all the, um, all the lichen. Once you've got past that bit and you unlock the shop, well, I should have played it on hard mode rather than going for expert difficulty straight away because then I'd have had more time to unlock all the guns and whatnot, but... Now, uh, it's fun. I do recommend watching Ignore the Noise in the background. It's just a video finishing uh, rendering. I do recommend watching the series. I loved the game, although there's a million YouTubers played it by this point. I don't see why I would be the one that you choose to watch, but... Which is always appreciated. It's a good story. I genuinely like the story. And my reactions through it all are 100% genuine because I've not watched anybody else play it other than Aqua. Um, and we did it in such a way that we both recorded a fair few episodes. 
which meant that when our episodes went out, we could watch them and we'd not spoil it for each other, if that makes any sense. Because we both wanted genuine reactions to the game all the way through, so it only seemed sensible to not watch anybody else. But yeah, I've literally watched nobody else play it. I've got no intentions of watching anybody else play it. All right, I'm just going to let time run out in case that's something, because I keep pressing leave store. I mean, it's not like I can fill anything up. Is there anything in the warehouse? Just out of curiosity. No. This should be contract complete, eh? What? I, I don't understand it. This pop-up shop should be finished by now. I mean, I'm going to order it all again because it's not coming out of my money anyway. And I am getting a thousand pound a day, so... I hope I've not gotten in some sort of bug. And I'm now stuck in this pop-up shop. Well, I ordered the stock again. We can fill the shop up again. But this isn't what I'm wanting to do with the campaign. Obviously, we're wanting to get to doing our own shop. Go to city. Is it because I've got to do 10 days in a row? I don't know. I honestly don't know. We'll do another day then, shall we? If I end up doing another full episode in this shop, I might have to, like, find a way out of this shop because I, I don't know what else to do. We've absolutely been here for 10 days already. And I've got too much order. I don't think there's enough room for me to get another cage in here. It's unfortunate. It'll be fine. I should be able to unload both of these, then. And really, I should have gone and got a drink between episodes. My throat, you would not believe how sore my throat is. Uh, that's what you get from sitting and talking to yourself for, like, 30 minutes. Spints? Spints? Not stints. Spints. Ah, delivery dudes here. I don't know what you guys have bought, because there's, like, nothing on the shelves. Let's see if we can get just a few of these racks filled up. They just love my clothes. Just love my clothes. Right, can we unload the rest? Like two items, eight items. Shut up. Ooh, don't super speed into the wall. Go, go, go. Excuse me. Come on, this has absolutely got to be the last day. Come on, don't don't ruin my motivation for King of Retail. I've already had my break. I was wanting to get stuck into this properly and, like, pr go for the proper difficult part of the game, which is the career mode. Don't do me like this game. Unless there's a way I've got to shut the sh store. But I don't know. I did Google it quickly between um, episodes. Nothing came up about pop-up shops being bugged out. I saw plenty of people saying that they don't do the pop-up shots because of the setup time, but I'm not being funny. You start off with that much cash. It's kind of difficult to not make it work. Again, this one. Just absolutely went full ham with it and it worked. Excuse me, get these shoes out. And get these out there. Get these out there. Shut up. Just check the warehouse. It should be empty now. Good. Right, so what are we talking about today then? Has anybody uh, been in Check Tag where X Blues channel out, by the way? Currently playing Ori Will of the Wisps after playing Ori in the Blind Forest. I actually finished that game myself. It is a cracking game. Very, very nearly had me in tears. At both the start and the end. And if you know, don't know what Ori is, it's like a platformer game. Not normally my cup of tea, but something went wrong with one of our 
I screwed all of that. Something went a little bit wrong halfway through Aqua's uh, series, so I bought the game and, like, got to where she was to give her my save file. Just trail per app. But, by that point, I was, like, so immersed in the game. It's like, well, I need to finish this now. So I actually ended up finishing it before she did. In fact, I remember her joining... Uh, I was streaming into my admin's rooms on just, like... One of my off days when I... Well, I probably already finished recording, knowing me. Um, I was just streaming in there. She joined and she's like, Oh, you're playing Ori? Where are you at? And it's like, no, don't watch it. Leave. I'm on the final bit. And she's just like, oh, oh, no. I don't want to watch. But this is what I mean about the Resident Evil. We didn't want to spoil each other's reactions to it. So... Um, Unless we knew where the other one was. And it, you should have heard the conversations where it's like, so did you get to this bit? It's like, what, what do you mean by this bit? The first one, it's like, have you got this gun? Or have you got a new pistol? Have you got a new shotgun? It's like, yeah, I've got that. But if you killed this thing, but and you'd always have to be dead vague. Cause it's like, we didn't want to ruin it. But actually, I think it worked out that we've uh, roughly recorded the same things at the same time. Within reason. You want this pink shirt, don't you? Great idea. Thought so. Thanks. Yeah. Glad you liked it, dude. No, I definitely recommend going and watching... Well, she's currently doing Will of the Wisp. Blind Forest has been finished now, so... I'd uh, definitely go and have a look. Like I say, it's such a sad introduction to the game. Um, somebody else popped up on my YouTube the other day while I was at work just flicking through... Um, I didn't even recognise the YouTube name, so I don't know why it popped up. It probably popped up because I watched Aqua play Ori. Um, this other girl. Literally, the introduction had her in tears. Like I said, when I was watching Aqua's uh, series at the start, it really hits you in the feels. From the word go. Like, right in the feels. And at the end as well. Again, I'm saying very little about it because I hate spoilers and anybody that watches uh, or has seen Doctor Who, River Song, spoilers, sweetie. Don't do them. Do not do spoilers. You whistle at me again, you bold mother trucker. And that's not to insult anybody that's bold. It was specifically that man right there that whistled at me. me. Yep, I'm here. Excuse me. You want this green shirt? It looks promising. Good, buy it. Thanks. You want these yellow pants? Yes, it actually asked me. Well, the black and yellow, but... Your happiness wasn't quite in it, was it? Your happiness wasn't quite in it. Well, I guess we could um, aim for 300 grand. I don't think we're going to get it, like, but... And I've not been very uh, mobile this uh, this day, have I? I can, if you let me press E on you. That's no euphemism for anything. Shut up. Anybody that takes my words out of context. <clears throat> I don't know how you take that one out of context. But I know it could be done. Oh, I'm aware that it could be done. Hey, yes, Studley. Uh, I'm, I'm meaning you. Me. Hey, help. Although. Hi, for anybody else to understand why I go straight to Studley for them sort of comments. You have got to come and join the Discord. Which is in the description below. Just give it a couple of days on my Discord server. I say my, it's our. It's me and Aqua's Discord server. It's ours together now. A couple of days on our Discord server, you will completely understand why I say studly. Don't take my words out of context. <laughs> it is rather amusing. You want these shoes. Oh, the Crocs. No, you don't want them. Alright, then he does. Come on, surely... The pop-up shop's going to disappear today. The only reason I really want it to disappear is so I can get the four grand. I want the four grand. In fact, I know what. If it doesn't disappear today, I'm going to keep running this shop off camera so I can get to like 30 grand. Because you don't want to keep seeing me running this shop. I'm not even expanding. I'm not looking to expand it. I can't. Well, I don't think I can expand it. But I don't want to because this money isn't mine. I just want to get enough money to start my own shop. Boom. That was naff. Mobile phone shop. It's literally going to be mobile phones to start with. And then maybe we'll branch into tablets. But we won't be going to computers and laptops. That'll be a different shop. 
Well, I'm saying that. I should really calm down with the recording and wait for feedbacks. If I do something completely different, then that's going to be kind of shocking, right? We've got two hours. Can we take 16 grand? I doubt it with the stock that's left in here. Honestly, that looks more like a flag than a skirt then. I don't know why. I just looked at it. It's like, why is she buying a flag? Come on. All of you need to spend about a grand each. We'll get to 290. We're not getting to 300. No, I was coming to help you, you miserable beast. Can you remember a time when nobody would buy these? They still don't buy them. That's where the joke is. And these shirts. Why does nobody like these shirts? What does this one say? Rush B. Why would you not want to rush B? Nice, a, a nice Counter-Strike reference. Now... Is that just a Counter-Strike reference, or is the games nowadays that that would be linked to? Because for me, that is Counter-Strike, Rush A or Rush B. Again, I'm going to wait for the timer to run out in case me ending day prematurely is doing something, but I don't know. Come on, please say the shop is shut. Give me my four and a half grand. Contract complete. It doesn't seem to be doing it. Resort is an increase in pensioners segment during the city. This shop should have shut by now. Projected profits, 63 grand I'm taking. What's this email? Is that about the royal thingamajig that we just saw? Uh, we've just got some things on sale. Order, reorder, add all. We can get it all in in one sitting, but I don't get it. This shop should be shut by now. Save. I always look at the keys to save. I don't know why. That's exit game. Can we expand the store? No, because it's not our shop. <laughs> I could have expanded it. Why does it cost less? I don't know, but I'm not doing it anyway. This shop should be shut by now. We've got like 21 levels out of this shop. We're now a popular store. Yes. We're nearly at the 20 grand as well. I think this is broken. I really do. How about if we go in here and then leave? Right, we're doing one more day here because we've absolutely been in here for 10 days now. Maybe it's 10 days in one sitting. Because you've got to think, I have saved and quit between... I don't know. We'll do this day, and if this day doesn't work, I'm just going to let the game run. We've completed the shop. I, I don't want to show you any more of this shop, because it's not a real shop. It's a fake shop. It's an imaginary shop. That and I really need to go and get a drink, so my throat is absolutely dying. <clears throat> but yeah, hopefully next episode we'll be able to start doing something else. Otherwise, I don't know what we're going to do. Do they expect you to play 10 in-game days before you, like, save and quit the pop-up shop, or... I mean, I'm going to have to do it now just to make sure. But in this sitting, I will have done six in-game days so far, because... Well, now it'd be seven, because last time I did four. This time I'll have done three. I'm waiting for the other delivery to come, by the way. Oh. Why did you need another delivery? There was space? Hmm... Yes, because she was clearly there before him. Right, let's get this unloaded. Move out of my warehouse doorway. And we can get all this unpacked. Don't you whistle at me, you scumbag. 
I am unloading this before we go. Oh no, I lost a customer. Oh. I lost two customers. Ha! I sold it to him as he was leaving still. Uh. I see you. I know. And what? Although, not to be funny, I kick off at my staff when they, um, the faffing around near the tills and people need serving. Oh, it's a bloody nightmare. Just sit on the goddamn till and serve people. Yeah? Not difficult. Ugh. Uh, I super sped then when I didn't need super speed. You'd think it was difficult sometimes. It's alright, I'm only having a little moan about work now. Only, only a little moan. Let's go. Move! Move! That's another gripe. I absolutely hate getting stuck behind a customer that has been freshly warmed up from the graveyard. Just move. I, I know you're there to leisurely browse around the shop, but for God's sake, people are working still. Get out of the way. Oh, and people's spatial awareness. I'm on a proper rant now, aren't I? People's spatial awareness. Right, so where I work, you pull stock around on these big metal things on wheels, right? And that's all I'm going to say, because then again, you can't limit it to where I work. So, they're not exactly quiet. As you can imagine, metal on wheels tends to not be that quiet. I can literally get within, like, two foot of somebody. And they can't hear it's behind them. I'm not being funny, but... I'm slightly concerned for them crossing the road. Because they could look both ways, see nothing, step out into the road, and not hear a car until it's running over the face. <clears throat> How can people have such bad spatial awareness is beyond me. I mean, don't get me wrong. If they're older customers, yes, you understand that the hearing's gone. But a lot of them aren't. A lot of them are like my age. Or slightly older, slightly younger. Just, just, uh, listen to your surroundings, for God's sake, people. Listen to your surroundings. Oh. Well, I don't think there's a way for me to show this. One minute. This is as good. This should work, right? Yes, this is Discord. First thing in the morning. <laughs> oh, dear. And that's about all I'm going to show you. I have been stood on the till this entire time, so it's fine. Ah, it's alright. I'll stop messing around now. Oh, dear God. Why did my camera go down there for King of Retail? I can't remember why I put it there. I'm going to sneeze, by the way. Ah, you've got to love the good morning gifts. Uh, I must say, my, mine's closer to Studley's good morning than Shifo's good morning. I tend to look like I've been dragged through a bush backwards when I wake up. I don't wake up looking this beautiful. And yes, that is massive amounts of sarcasm. Just so you know. I I'm not even that bothered in trying to sell to you people anymore. I I'm just wanting to get through the days and get this shop over and done with. And the more times I get off the... Just buy a shoe, dude. Yes, it's perfect and you're not going to buy it, are you? Bloody knew it. The more times I get off the till, the more times I slow down time. So let's just sit here and whiz through it, shall we? Because if it doesn't shut the shop today, then I'm just going to be sat here for a fair few more days past this. We'll say, if I've got to sit and just watch days pass by, I will get it so that we've got 30 grand sat in the bank, and then we'll start tomorrow by going to the, um, the town hall and doing whatever we need to do. That was a busy period, wasn't it? Da ding da ding da ding That's all I could hear. Oh, we could hear. But no, this pop-up shop should have gone by now. We're definitely 10 days in. The only thing I can think is because I did part of the 10 days then saved, quit, and I've come back to it, it's reset the 10-day timer. So I'm reckoning another three days on top of this at the very most would end the shop. Well, you'll know at the start of next episode if my ideas worked, because I'll st start it where it says contract complete, if that's the case. If not, 
then we're just going to start at the city hall and I'm going to have to Google why this pop-up shop's not popping down. Yeah, you, you could probably take that one out of context and make some jokes out of it. Probably. Well. What else have we got to talk about? I've actually run out of things to talk about. I've run out of things to talk about in this shop because... I'm not doing anything. I've literally filled in the shop and then sitting here all day. 300,000. I won't clickbait the title, don't worry. Although you already know what the title is because you've clicked on the video already. What an idiot. What an idiot. Yeah, people buy what they buy. Excuse me. I'm starting to sound like the deeper voiced people in this game. It's alright. I'll be going for a drink as soon as this episode's finished. Don't you guys worry. My throat will be fine. Ka-ching, ka-ching. I know it's simple, but I just want to get into a shop that we've decorated. And by we, I kind of mean me, because I will have decorated it miles before you guys see it, if I keep in front with the recordings this far. Yeah, we're getting more accountants in now. We can tell by the white shirts. I do kind of need to learn what... Um, what colour shirt matches what uh, section or segment? Demographics probably the best word, isn't it? Hey, because then at a glance I might be able to tell which demographic were suited more. Unless a rainbow walks in. Hey. There's more green in here than anything. Hey, got a, second. a couple of scions. Hey, a couple of accountants. Hey. See? With the way that I buy stock, I don't just go for one demographic. I go for all of them. But maybe in doing that, I put other demographics off. Maybe What if we bought only stuff for, like, celebrities? Would only celebrities come in and nobody else? And maybe if we're putting cheap stuff in somewhere that celebrities would go, they wouldn't go there because there's cheap stuff there? Do we think that's how it works? Right, it looks like this shop's staying open still. Please be an email telling me it's shut. It's the Royal Opera Show. Order. At all. We really didn't sell that much that day. But this is where I'm going to save. We're going to go into this and we can save on the map. I don't get it. I don't honestly get it. So I'm going to have to sit for a few more days now. I guess it's a bit cheaty because I'm going to get more experience here. But as you've seen, it takes a while. Yeah, this pop-up shop is not disappearing at all. Right, so I'm going to do a few days off camera. I'm saying three days should be ten. So I did four in yesterday's episode. I've done three in today's episode. So if I do three more days and this is still here, we're going to the city hall. Yeah? Yeah. But that's in next episode. We've got the 20 grand that I need anyway, so why not? Anyway, that's going to be it for today's episode. So thank you very much for watching. If you've enjoyed the video, feel free to leave a like. Don't forget to subscribe if you'd like to see some more comments and feedback. Greatly appreciated as always. And as mentioned before, in the description below is a link to mine and Acrex Blues Discord server. Come have a look, see what you think. Anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Cheers.